Hello all, hope you are doing good. Well, uh, we are going to discuss about district mental health program today. District mental health program is a part of national mental health program. Okay, so before going to district mental health program, I just want to repeat what is national mental health program. National mental health program is a program to provide mental health services to all the people with available resources and it is came into force on 1982. And this district mental health program is a part of this national mental health program and it was started under this national mental health program to decentralize mental health services. That means come out from the four walls of the hospital to community to provide mental health services at community level by integrating or mixing mental health with general health care delivery system. This district mental health program was launched in 1996 in four districts under national mental health program and was expanded to 27 districts of country by the end of 9th five-year plan period. Presently, the district mental health program is being implemented in 123 districts of the country. So this is the development of district mental health program. The district mental health program is a part of national mental program and it is launched in 1996 in four districts. And this program is providing care to the people, those who are in the district and sub-district level. That means provide basic mental health care to everyone, so every needy people. That's the aim of this district mental health program. What is the objective of this district mental health program that we are going to see now? The major objectives of this district mental health programs are provide community mental health services to everyone with the use of by using available resources and integration of mental health with general health services. That means combining mental health services with general health services. While combining this general health services with mental health services means we can reach to more people. That's the uh, that's the main benefit of integration of mental health services with general health services. So these are all the two objectives of this district mental health program. First one is provide community mental health services and second one integration of mental health with general health services while coming to the services what are all the services we can see means training of mental health team that is the main services they have given through this district mental health program training of all the mental health professionals okay all the mental health team to provide best and accurate care to the people then increase the awareness and reduce the stigma related to mental health problem of course we know that there is a st st stigma or there is a discrimination still we can see in the field of mental health pro programs and mental health services so this district mental health program or tmhp have tried to increase the awareness of people related to mental health and importance of mental well-being at the same time to reduce the discrimination and stigma and another thing is provide service for early detection and treatment of mental health illness in the community so if you are detecting earlier you can give treatment early and if you give treatment earlier we can reduce the severity of this disease or of mental illness because mental illness is also the same like physical illness also if you are finding out early means we can start the treatment and we can make the patient to come out from the condition and we can make the person to live like a normal person so district mental health services have decided to uh, do the services for early detection and the treatment of mental illness in the community. Then we will see the major components of the district mental health program. The major components include training of every workers in the mental health team, provide public education and outpatient department and indoor services for early detection of disease and research. These are all the major components of this district mental health program. Training program to all the health workers, public education. Public education is very, very important because public education means general education to people because people are not uh, aware about the importance of mental illness and aware about the importance of mental well-being and also public education will improve the mental health and well-being of the person and another thing is outpatient department and in the patient department services for early detection of disease and of course researchers in the field of community mental health services and mental health development so these are all the major components of this district mental health program then while coming to the team who are all working under this district mental health program means we can see a psychiatrist a clinical psychologist a psychiatric social worker a psychiatric nurse a community nurse, a program manager, 
a program or case registry assistant and a record keeper. So these many members are working together to provide best possible Mendaha service or Mendaha care to the people. So this district Mendaha program we cannot give with the uh, help of this team. A, this team need to work together to provide Mendaha services to the people. So this is the team of district Mendaha program. In 2008, the government of India re-strategized or revised the district mental health program and new ad components also they have added to this district mental health program and this new added components are life skill education services, counseling services in the school, college and college counseling services. So these are all the added components, life skill education services counselings in the schools and colleges and apart from that they have started to do the services in the workplace especially to reduce the stress which is arising from the work so workplace stress management to the employees and also suicide and prevention services at clinical services so so these are all the new added components of this district mental health program in 2008 because in 2008 the government of India re-strategized this district mental health program strategies or revised the district mental health program strategies. So they have added new components like life skill education counseling, life skill education services, counseling in the schools and colleges workplace stress management services and suicide edge prevention services okay these are all the added component of this district mental health program then what are all the activities we can see under this district mental health program means provision of basic mental health services at the community level provision of mental health outpatient and inpatient mental health services the 10 bedded inpatient facilities outreach components such as satellite clinic satellite clinic means give care in the rural area with the help of small clinic setup okay four satellite clinic per month at community health center and primary health center with the help of this district mental health program team okay these are all the activities we can see under this district mental health program provision of mental health services to everyone at the community level both inpatient and outpatient treatment satellite clinic services etc and what are all the targeted intervention of interventions of this district mental health program means already i've told you the same thing i'm repeating again what are all the targeted interventions of this district mental health program means life skill education counseling college counseling workplace stress management suicide prevention services and training to the health professionals at district and sub district level awareness camp these are all some of the targeted interventions of this district mental health program life skill education Counseling in the schools and colleges, counseling and stress management in the workplace, suicide prevention services, training to the health professionals and awareness camp to the public to improve the public awareness related to mental health program. Apart from that, improve the community participation. How we can improve the community participation means integrate the service with self-help groups, family and caregiver groups and non-governmental organizations once we have once we have planned to do this thing or once we are improving this community participation means automatically the reach will increase once the reach will increase and every uh, every person will get community mental health treatment so community participation also uh, was an aim of this and district mental health program then another thing is man for provision who are all worked okay they have provided many manpower they have provided a number of people or they have appointed a number of qualified professional to provide mental health services to the people the man manpower provision included psychiatrist the clinical psychologist nurse social worker community nurse evaluation officer registry assistant and ward assistant so all these people work together to provide mental health services and this is the team and already we had a discussion regarding the team okay so manpower provision of this dmhp means uh, that that is the community mental health team and also through this district mental health program government have decided to give the financial support up to 83.2 lakhs rupees per district mental health program so this district mental health program completed around three decades and we got a lot of lessons regarding 
the district mental health program, how to improve mental health services and integrate mental health services with general health services. So this is about district mental health program. So district mental health program is a part of national mental health program and it is enacted in 1996. And what is the aim of this district mental health program or what was the aim of this district mental health program is provide mental health services through district and sub-district level, training to the mental health provider, Pro, pro, uh, pro, uh, mental health uh, team and mental health professionals and improve the community participation and improve the public awareness regarding the mental health services. Okay. They have planned many things, they have uh, they have uh, did lot of things but still we can see a slow growth in the field of this district mental health program but still it is growing. Okay, this is about district mental health program in India. Hope you understand. Thank you.